What is up everybody? I am Crimson Thunder here. Welcome to this retake of Spalkin BMS 4.33 U5. <coughs> now previously, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> some of you may have wondering why I, did I say a retake, why not, uh, why not a continuation? Well, for those of you who might be subscribed, I have to, I am unfortunately up, um, have to announce that all my, I have deleted all of my previous videos because on that particular campaign that I was doing in North, North Korea in Operation Tiger Spirit, because I had, because of I had some serious computer issues that involved getting Geek Squad in order to, involved in order to actually get it repaired, I unfortunately lost the entire campaign uh, file in the process. It's unfor it is very unfortunate that it had to be this way, but we had no other choice. So anyway, we're gonna have to redo this entire campaign, unfortunately. Now here. We're going to be setting the default settings, so I want to make it at least veteran. At least veteran. So the um, so we have like evenly matched, and and everybody's not like stupid or anything. So, because I'm not I'm not really that skilled enough to try this entire thing on Ace just yet, where we have like an entire wave of talents coming through here. Now I will actually be be playing through all three of the of the campaigns at first, and before, uh, before I actually go on to doing a different kind of campaign along the way. Along the way, uh, and in addition to Falcon DMS 4.33 U5, I will also be redoing the entire campaign for Silent Hunter 4 with the Rally's Real mod once I have that fully up and running. So we and and what we have here is three campaigns we can choose from. We have one called Operation Tiger Spirit, which I will be actually redoing, which is a North Korean invasion that got repulsed very quickly, but then the North is regrouping for a massive counterattack with China. We have Operation Rolling Fire, which is a in, uh, in just a pure, just the start of a, a second Korean War with them invading the South, and lastly we have Operation Iron Fortress, where the North Korea North Korea basically has broken through the defenses, to, took Seoul, and they've been forced back over to Pusan, and we must. Uh, we must uh, repel uh, repel all the, the final uh, invasion force before uh, before reinforcements arrive, drive them all back, and to retake Seoul. Despite the odds against it, North Korea made a desperate military gamble and attacked the South. The combined forces army proved equal to the challenge and repulsed the invasion before it gained much ground. The turnabout has left the DPRK army retreating with the combined forces in pursuit. The battle has gone so well that the South Korean leadership is openly talking about uniting the peninsula under the flag of the ROK. To succeed, the combined forces must keep the pressure on the northern army to prevent it from reorganizing. Dissension over this plan is surfacing in the UN, which technically exercises control over the combined forces. China and the CIS are leading a coalition of member states calling for a ceasefire and restoration of the DMZ. The war rages on unabated as the politicians debate. The U.S. is committing fresh air and ground units hoping to maintain the momentum of the counterattack. Okay, so basically right there is what she ended up saying. The <coughs> The, we were able to um, repulse the North Korean invasion before they able were they able to get much ground. We occupied Pyongyang and Wosan in, in order to re remove the North Korean dictatorship, which back in the time in I think 1998 when this game was officially released, at that time that could have been Jung, Kim Jong uh, Il. <coughs> yeah, which is the uh, father of. 
Kim Jong uh, Kim Jong Un, I believe, is what his name is. And now we're going to be selecting our air base. We are going to be the we can pick uh, we can be the 80th if we wanted to over at Hangzhou Air Base. We could actually uh, be an F-15 uh, Strike Eagle out of Seoul, uh, Bay S Squadron out of Seoul. There's no point in going to Kusan or or Pusan so, uh, unless we are able to do so. We could be the <coughs> South Korean Air Force and be at the KF uh, KF-16 Cs, and we also have. Um, a bomber base or uh, out of Japan with with that also has some C-17s but for this playthrough we are going to be the 14th fighter squadron at a Kimpo Air Base which is uh, which is uh, formerly known as the Samurais normally based out of Japan but with this particular playthrough we are going to be going into Kimpo South Korea and when it begins since and unless you absolutely uh, want to command uh, all the units uh, carefully since this is a um, full-time this is this is a um, grand war type of strategy here I would leave these alone these are the type of missions that will actually change by itself as it progresses and where to focus on uh, all their uh, terror strikes. And once we hit and once we hit there, the campaign will begin. And immediately we get this. Air raid sirens blared across South Korean cities after China's entrance into the war reinforced the North's faltering air forces. People moved calmly off the streets and into shelters to wait out the incoming airstrikes. At an emergency security session, South Korea recalled its ambassador to Peking. While its army braced itself against the waves of Chinese infantry heading to the front. Okay, so as you probably have saw that immediately when the um, when the Operation Tiger Spirit begins, China will automatically be into the war by the clock. Their army is well hidden up here, but all but all I have to tell you is they're massing for a, a counterattack so, to retake all of a uh, to retake what is from the north and push everybody back uh, into South Korea. We are not going to allow that. Unfortunately, I'm going to split this video into two parts because. From my last time, I had tried to create this kind of a thing, which show you how to how to strategize. For some reason, OBS Studio is very limited, so I'm going to join back with you and what kind of a, uh, about what kind of a mission we're going to. Though it will likely be a destroy enemy air defenses type of mission. So stand by. I'll be right back. Hey, what's up guys? It's Crimson Thunder here. We are back. And now let's get this jet started. Now the mission that we are going to be doing is indeed going to be destroy enemy air defenses. And we are actually going to... It's indeed a... Um, one of the ones that were going up against an SA-5 site, which I made all the plans ahead of time. So it's going to go test all of our systems out. Something you should do in order before you start every flight, just to make sure all, all the stuff is working properly. Let's 
Okay, engine spooling up. We gotta test our fire systems. Make sure that the engine fire and engine overheat is should be on. Uh, now for our oxygen system, this oxygen low should be on the whole for ten seconds. check one thing I'll hit pause for just a quick sec okay pro heat should flash Up. Altitude. Warning. Jammer. Counter. Cap flare. Low. Out. Lock. IFF. Caution. Bingo. Data. Now I'm going to turn on uh, avionics. I mean, this is to align norm. Left and right hard points on. Flight control radar on. It's going to altitude. Turn on the HUD. Up front controls. Comms are on. I should go to main. We don't need the ILS right now. On the seat. I like putting the EWS mode to semi. Turn on the RWR power. Load our data cartridge into the system. And what I like doing that I noticed that um, Steel Beast Calvary doesn't do this much, but it, I always like to enable this so we get the floating diamond. The floating diamond actually prioritizes the highest threat. So in this point right now, the biggest threat that to my aircraft is actually this Patriot missile. Even though it's friendly, um, but it just wants to show me which one's going to be the most li uh, more likely to actually shoot at me first. Obviously, the um, there's F-15 contacts. There's also a the Century that we also have. Battle Channel Six. Yeah. Okay. Sour Panther 101, request Q and H. 
Panther. One, Kim Po, approach. Three, zero, five, nine. Must be a really high pressure out there. We're going to clear all the faults here so there's no so that resets all of this. And this should not be anything um, on the test screen now. We'll wait for this to f finish finalizing. We will go ahead and make sure that this AGM-88 uh, sensor is powered on because we won't be able to fly without it. Get the cool. The A9 sensor should be growling. Now, if I turn on the hard mount to queue, if I just go ahead and look around some, should be tracking. Now, if I take it to board instead of slave, the this little diamond should be alright. There. Now if I switch to dark fight mode, I don't want this down on say I want it to boil. Everything looks good to go. Can't tell on that. The missile override, and that's what I use for my air-to-air -air missiles. The INS is aligned, so we'll go to nav. There's a little. We have I mark some stuff out on the map. We have a little dashed line here that actually will show our tanker's path in case we ever have to get refuel which we're likely not going to need in this mission the mission to simply take out some enemy radar sites our WR systems are, are good to go we'll turn on the jammer so that's good to go. Our departure time is 8 is 8:59, so we'll roll at 8:53, which will be in nine in four minutes. We'll go ahead and do. Our That's how we remove trucks. Panther, 1-1, one, one, hold short.
Now Intel says that there's a there's a few air bases that are not too far from the target that also house MiG 21s and MiG 23s. So we got to be careful of those. And once we t when we take once we take off, we're going to go to twenty two thousand. We'll go to twenty two thousand, and then and then proceed directly to target from there. Um, uh, fo uh, following the flight path that we had that we that we act that was actually uh, created. Tower Panther 1 1 ready for departure. Taxi runway 1 4 right. Hold short. 1 4 right. Panther, 1-2, taxi, runway 1-4, right. The winter calm. Tower, wind check. Tower, Panther, 1-1, one, one, wind check. Panther 1-1, one, one, Kim Po approach 180 at 04 knots. Fury 1-1, one, one, ready for departure. Fury, 1-1, one, one, taxi, runway 1-4, right. Fury, 1-2, taxi, runway 1-4, right.
Panther, 1-1, one, one, Kim Po Tower. Taxi clear of the runway. Panther, 1-1, one, one, Kim Po Tower. You are cleared for takeoff, runway 1-4 right. And we're cleared for takeoff. Lined up next set. Throttle ninety. Release brakes. Burn. Panther, 1-1, one, one, Kim Po Tower, resume on navigation. Fury, 1-1, one, one, Kim Po Tower, clear for departure. Panther, 1 Panther 1 2, go spread. Panther 2, go spread. 2, going spread. Lion 1 1, ready for departure. Lion 1 1, taxi, runway 1 4 right. Switch over to channel one. Chalice one, Panther one one, request picture. Panther one one, Chalice one, picture clear. Panther two, go wedge. Now, one of the most important things about your wingman over there is that you don't ever leave your wingman at all. That's the one big rule that we all learned in Top Gun. Because he will play, he for the most part will play a defensive role unless you tell him otherwise. The light lead plays more of the offensive role.
there is our F5 since it's a very long ranged unit that's really designed more to take out shoot at enemy bombers instead of fighters but with that we're out outside of lethality range which is more determined by this uh, this area here this is the uh, the stuff that's in here is more like lethal range Because if you ever get fired on, you'll hear something like this. Along with that little flashing that you actually ended up seeing. You know, there's not actually one firing on me, but there, this is because I ended up hitting one. But if it did, there also would be a flashing circle around the contact. Which means that their um, that their missile is tracking on you. Go burner. I'll just go a little bit burning up there. We don't need this much fuel right for this flight. the autopilot. Excuse me one second. Okay, that's what I'm Reset my track. I'm going to reset my track eye on the center right here. Going to preset oh, our harm missiles here, since I do know um, what what the uh, thing is going to be. We're going to be setting it's an SI five. So that's set. This should be the. The M120 first. This looks like a flight of F-16s that are they're coming in. Century one. Chalice one. Panther one one. Declare. Panther one one. Chalice one. Contact is friendly.
Okay, our um We have our group of other S16s that are in our package that are coming up now. They're actually the ones that take out the SA-5 launchers. What these missiles are, are the AGM-88 Harm. These missiles are designed to destroy enemy radars as they track by the radar emissions. Definitely not right with my mini stick. I'll have to recalibrate that later on to see what the hell's going on. That well, looks like another. Looks like another group of F six. Probably South Korean F-16s. We got a Hawk missile um, site actually um, that's tracking us. It spotted us. We've got plenty of fuel. But way, we've got more than enough fuel left to be able to do this mission. We're actually so far out, we should have had our bingo 2,500 pounds. Push it up a little bit now. Got a lot of hot missiles around. Century one, Panther one, one, declare. Chalice. One, contact confirmed hostile. They're heading away from us, though. Sentry declare. Chalice one, Palace Panther one one declare. Chalice one, Panther one one declare. Panther one one, Chalice one, contact is outlaw. Panther one two, fence in. Panther two, fence in. 
two, fenced in. Going to drop to 1900 feet. Python 1, Chalice 1, be advised, threat aircraft, bullseye 100, zero, zero, 100 miles, 21,000. That's the ones that just passed us. Now let's not spend too much time, um... Taking these out, cause just in case that those, um, they're probably MiG 21s, I think. Python 2, music on. Panther 2 will say status. 2, all clear. Python 1, Chalice 1, be advised. Threat aircraft, bullseye 100, zero, zero, 100 miles, 21,000.
Python, one, Chalice, one, be advised, hostile aircraft bearing 275, 25 miles, 16,000. Alright, my wingman will cover me. Python, one, Python, one, one, engage targets, bearing 270, 20 miles, 11,000. Big 23s. Yeah, player. Python, one, Python, one, one, engage targets, bearing two, six, five, twenty miles, ten thousand. Fifty miles. Python, one, Chalice, one, be advised, hostile aircraft, two, six, zero, fifteen miles, ten thousand. Let's fire and forget. The second one, I'm gonna target this Sam over here. Briefed. Magnum. We are Arizona. Python, one, Python, one, one. Engage targets. Bearing two, three, five, twenty miles, sixteen thousand. Python, one, Python, one, one. Engage targets. Bearing two, three, five, twenty miles, sixteen thousand. Python, one, Chalice, one, be advised, hostile aircraft bearing 240, 25 miles, 16,000. Python, one, Python, one, one, engage targets, bearing 240, 25 miles, 16,000. Python, one, Python, one, one, engage targets, bearing 245, 25 miles, 16,000. Two say status. Panther, one, two, target is bearing two, five, zero, twenty five miles. Sent Chalice one, Panther one, one, declare. Panther one, Chalice one, the area appears to be clear. Hey, we got MiG 29s too. Whoa. Python one, attack target, bullseye, zero, seven, five, one hundred sixty miles. Piss some people off. Python, one, Chalice, one, be advised, hostile aircraft bearing 280, 20 miles, 15,000. Chalice, one, Panther, one, one, declare. Panther, one, one, Chalice, one, contact is friendly. Century, one, Panther, one, one, declare. Panther, 1-1, one, one, Chalice, 1, contact confirmed hostile, I need as Su-30. Chinese Su-30. Dude, that's even more dangerous. Where is that guy? Python, one, Chalice, one, be advised, hostile aircraft bearing three, two, zero, Box five two. miles, Chaff, flare, Chaff, flare, Chaff, flare, Chaff, flare. Splash. Two, two. Two clear my six. Chaff, flare, chaff, flare. Chaff, flare. Incoming, big 23, Caution. 11 o'clock, low. Two. Python, 
Python. One. Python. One one. Engage target. Bearing three six zero. One mile. Eleven thousand. Max two. Python. Altitude. One, Dallas, one, Altitude. Hostile aircraft bearing zero two five. One mile. Eleven thousand. Two, rejoin. Panther, one, two, on my way. Chalice one Panther one one buggy dope. Panther one Chalice one Harris Hostel Su thirty two ship bullseye zero nine five one hundred miles ten thousand. Two attack my target. Panther two attack my target. Two attack my target. Two. Counter, counter, counter. Chaff, flare. Chaff, flare. That's a missile. Altitude, altitude. Attack my target. Two, attack my target. Two. Panther, one, two, unable. Two, say weapons. Panther, one, two. Two, radar. Counter. Two, heat. Shield state, seven, three. Alright, let's get the f let's get the hell out of here. Chaff, flare, altitude, altitude. Python, one chalice, one be advised. Low. Red aircraft, bullseye, zero seven five, one hundred sixty miles, twenty thousand. All right. Two rejoin. Two rejoin. Panther, one two, on my way. Rifle. Rifle. Get out of their engagement range. Let's not do anything. Let's not do anything dumb.
Chalice 1, Panther 1-1, one, one. we'll get open. Panther 1, Chalice 1, nearest hostile, MiG-23s, 2 ship, bullseye, 075, 160 miles, 24,000. Python 1, Chalice 1, be advised, threat aircraft, bullseye, 075, 160 miles, 24,000. Let's not lay with anybody else today. We already had a close encounter with the MiGs. I think as long as our primary target has been destroyed, which is that SI-5 site, we should be fine. And one of those SI-2s is just a secondary. But I think we got a kill on a couple of MiG 23s with some um, sidewinders. Python, one one, good hit. And it looks like Python flights scoring some hits. Anyway, we are definitely RTB because we are not going to play stupid. Unless I think those are F 18s maybe. Python, one, Chalice, one, be advised. Threat aircraft, bullseye, zero seven five, one hundred sixty miles, twenty five thousand. Definitely got the feel for us for heading home. So let's actually uh, head directly for home. Two, go edge. Two, going wedge. Sentry declare. Panther, 1-1, one, one, Chalice, 1, contact confirmed, hostile, ID as Su-27. Since we got the altitude advantage on them. Also, uh, that 900 feet, I think. Two in position. They're turning cold. Trying to drag us into um Let's head back. Let's head. To, let's head for home.
Unlike with um, with arcade games, this particular game, shooting down enemies is not always your best option. Unless you should always think about it first before you actually plan to engage. As long as we keep... Actually, only going 270 knots. So we got the speed advantage. Box three. Panther one one. Let me at him. It's tracking. Yep, they're definitely speeding up, but I don't think it's going to catch them. Uh -oh. Engaging, Su-27, 12 o'clock, low. There's an SA-3 below us, so don't don't go too low. Engaging, Su-27, 11 o'clock, low. Engaging, Su-27, 11 o'clock, low. Yeah, that's 627. Twenty-seven, twelve o'clock, low. Engaging, sir. Twenty-seven, twelve o'clock, low. Century one, Chalice one, Panther one one, declare. Engaging, sir. Twenty-seven, twelve o'clock, low. Chalice one, Panther one one, declare. Engaging, sir. Twenty-seven, twelve o'clock, low. Panther one one, Chalice one, contact us friendly. Two rejoin. Panther one two on my way. There's the. I think they're good. I think they're disengaging. All right. Yeah, we got a we got a spike mud two at eight o'clock.
Shaft Flare. Two music off. Two music off. Two fence out. Two fence out. I still have plenty of fuel for, uh, for when I get home. to go with two going wedge well at least on this mission we did kill at least two mig 23s in the dog fight unexpectedly Probably when I ended up um, overstressing the air, air, air cream or pulling a uh, high G before dropping the tanks. Two safe fuel. Two fuel state four seven. I'm at three eight. Two say weapons. Two say weapons. Panther, one, two. Two, radar. Two, heat. Fuel state, four, six. Bunch of Patriot batter uh, batteries um, tracking us. <coughs> well, all I can say is, as long as the SA-5 radar is destroyed, it, it's a mission success.
have to wait till we get to at least 30 miles for announcement where I'm landing. But what we can do is we can go back to channel 15. We have 43 miles in it. Cowboy, 1-2, turn left to final approach course, 1-4-5, check speed. Final approach course, 1-4-5. Descent now. Cowboy, one, two, on final. Tower, Panther 1 1, inbound for landing. Good morning, Panther 1, Kim Po approach. Take spacing and expect vectors to runway 1 4 left. Panther 1-1, one, one, descend to 4000, maintain 300 knots, turn right heading 280. Good morning, Cowboy 1-2, Kim Po Tower, cleared for landing, runway 14 left, check gear down. Now here, you follow the ATC instructions. Panther 1-1, one, one, orbit for spacing 4,000. Panther 1-2, orbit for spacing 5,000. Panther 1-2, maintain 300 knots.
Now this is to avoid um, traffic collisions. Walker, 1-1, one, one, orbit for spacing, 4,000. Panther, 1-2, descend to 4,000, maintain 250 knots, turn right heading 185, runway 14 left. Panther, altitude, one, one, altitude. 4,000. Panther, 1-1, one, one, maintain 250 knots, turn left heading 210, runway 14 left. Panther, 1-1, one, one, turn left heading 210. Panther, 1-1, one, one, descend to 3,000, maintain 300 zero, zero knots, turn right heading 220. Right to 220. Panther, 1-1, one, one, descend to 2,000, maintain 230 knots, turn left heading 140, vectors to final, runway 14 left. Panther, 1-1, one, one, turn left heading 135. Panther, 1-1, one, one, turn right heading, 140. Panther, 1-2, descend to, 3000, maintain 300 knots, runway 14 left. Panther, 1-1, one, one, 
Panther 11, descend to 2000, maintain 230 knots. Panther 12, turn left heading 150. The runway's out. In, the runway's in sight. Ten miles, gear down. Panther, 1-1, one, one. turn left to final approach course, 1-4-5, slow to approach speed. Panther 1-1 one, one on final. Panther 1-2, turn left to final approach course, 1-4-5, slow to approach speed. Short, 1-1, one, one. inbound for landing. Good morning, Panther, 1-1, one, one. Kim Ho Tower, cleared for landing, runway 1-4 left, check gear down. Good morning, Shark, 1, Kim Ho Approach, 9, runway 1-4 left, green, welcome green back. Land. Panther, 1-2, final approach. And touchdown. Shark 1-1, one, one, orbit for spacing 4000. Shark 1-1, one, one, maintain 300 knots. Good morning, Panther 1-2, Kim Po Tower, cleared for landing, runway 1-4 left, check gear down. Shark 1-2, orbit for spacing 5000. Shark 1-2, maintain 300 knots. Shark 1-1, one, one, descend to 4000, maintain 250 knots, turn left heading 185, runway 14 left. Serpent 1-1, one, one, inbound for landing. 
Good morning. Serpent 1, Kim Po approach, runway 14 left. So now I have to land in, make sure the speed brakes are retracted. And now we're going to go park into, into a parking area on the side of the um, near field. Shark, 1-2, turn left, heading 185, runway 14 left. Serpent, 1-1, one, one, orbit for spacing, 4,000. Serpent, 1-1, one, one, maintain 300 knots. Serpent, 1-2, orbit for spacing, 5,000. Serpent, 1-2, maintain 300 knots. Tower, insert chocks. Let's go see how we did. Obviously, we expended quite a bit of weapons. Chalice 2, and the mission contact. was a success. Hold on, 1, 2, 5, 60 miles, 26,000. Scout 2, 1, engaging, target bullseye, 1, 4, 0, 60 miles, 1,000. Scout 5, so, let's go home. So overall, we did the square, destroy the square pair radar, which is the one that is going to be for the tra for tracking us. And... Viper 1, 1, engaging, we target bullseye, they are 1, no 2, 5, 60 miles, 18,000. That cleared our way for our, for strikes. Also, we have destroyed two MiG 23s in a, in a dogfight, and we did deter a Su 23 from coming after, from harassing any of our forces. Python looks like they ended up doing some good uh, some good work as far as destroying some some other stuff. They destroyed two, two of the launchers have actually been destroyed by uh, from Python. So overall, the mission was a success. So until until next time, I am Crimson Thunder. See you later, everybody.